Okay, if you have four of these things, your dua will be accepted by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So whatever you do, whenever you make dua, ensure that you have four of these things. Okay, the first one is that you need yaqeen. You need to be certain. You need to, be, you need to have certainty in your heart when you're making dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Don't be weak and don't say, Oh Allah, if you accept this, if you accept that. No, make dua with a certainty, a level of certainty in your heart that you know that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will accept your dua, okay? Have certainty, have yaqeen when you're making dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala because you're talking to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, right? You're talking to someone who owns the entire earth, heavens, everything, the entire universe, right? So you have to have yaqeen when you're talking to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The second thing is you need to have khushu when you're making dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, okay? Khushu, focus. Don't be making dua and then you don't know what you're reading, you don't know what you're saying, you're just, your mind is someplace else, right? You need to have khushu when you're making dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Second part, okay? Understand what you're reading, understanding what you're asking Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for, okay? And try to feel what you're reading, okay? It's better if you can cry as well when you're asking or when you're making dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The third thing is you cannot rush when you're making dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Okay, you're talking to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the one who controls space and time. So don't rush. You have to understand that when if you, you're the slave here, right? You're the slave of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So why are you rushing when you're making dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? It's as if you 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 just want to get it over and done with, right? You're talking to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he can give you anything that your heart desires. So don't rush when you're making Dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Take your time. Savor that moment. Savor that moment of talking to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Okay? So have certainty. Don't rush. Have khushu. The fourth one is you need to eat halal food. Ensure that whatever that enters your body is halal. Okay? Everything. Whatever that you consume, whatever that you drink, everything is halal. Don't consume things that are haram. Okay, if things that are uncertain or shubha, leave it. Okay, leave it. Ensure that everything that goes into your body is halal. These are the four things to ensure that your dua is accepted by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Peace.